very, wow, this is like, I thought this was going to be paper. No, this is like. So far, now that I've gotten back on track, I'm really knocking out videos. So today I'm going to show you a new product that we got for our house. You see this title in the thumbnail, and me personally, I think that alarms are a very good deterrent for criminals. I mean, of course, I mean, if you have a brain, which I know some of them don't, if you have a brain and you're a criminal and you, you see a, a house that has a security sign, naturally you should go to the house next to it because, I mean, why would you go to the one where, like, there's a really good chance you'll get caught? But... The other day I was on Amazon and uh, basically came across what I felt was a pretty sweet deal. Now I've wanted to get an alarm system for this house since we moved here. Basically I was originally going to go with a ring system and well if you read any news about ring uh, I would not recommend having ring anything, ring cameras. I don't recommend having anything personally from Amazon. I have no Amazon products in my house at all because I don't trust them as a company. I also didn't want to pay like 30 bucks for ADT. To me, 20, 30 dollars for an alarm system every month, it's flat out not worth it in my opinion. Um, it's, it's something that may be used, may not be used, so to me the 10 to 15 dollar range is about where it should be. I bought, I bought the Kangaroo alarm system, which is made by some old uh, people that worked at Google. They then branched, you know, left there and made this. So um, this is a complete kit. I haven't opened it yet. Um, I'm not really going to do a setup of this. It's going to be more so of a unboxing, and then I'll probably show you a little bit of the app and maybe some of the features. But I'm not really going to do a setup because they've sent me a few emails about this, and basically the app will guide you through all of it. It will guide you through syncing these devices to this, getting it on your Wi-Fi, the app is going to help you with everything. So this is just to kind of show you what they look like and um, give you a little review maybe of the app. So uh, yeah, let's take a look at this. So as you see on the box, this is a total home monitoring system. And what I was able to do was the service cost $10 per month. I was able to pay for a year of service and I got this kit for free. So I won't have a monthly fee till next year and then it'll only be $10 per month. This kit, I think, is $2.99 if they don't have the special going still, which, to be honest, for what you get, and with it being $2, uh, and with it being $10 per month is not that bad. Um, in this kit, uh, these are a lot like the Google Nest uh, Protect sensors, where that uh, they're a door sensor as well as a motion sensor. So it's kind of like two in one for you here. So the way my downstairs is set up, I'll be able to like blink at the whole downstairs with motion and have one of these on each door. So that'll be great. This is of course your keypad and your siren and everything. These are little key tags that you can have where you can just tap and go. Another thing that the uh, Nest has. And this here is a water and climate sensor. That's for if there's a leak. I think I'll put this somewhere where there may be a leak and um, it also is climate, so like I guess if it's going to be cold that night, it'll tell me so that my pipes don't freeze. You download the Kangaroo Security app on the App Store or Google Play Store, and um, detects motion and entry, alerts your phone, and triggers a siren. Um, and then yes, they have monthly plans that are free and professional monitoring available. I have the uh, I think the ultimate plan, and then this uh, just kind of tells you what comes in the box, of course. You get a yard sign, which is dope. You don't get one of those with ring or anyone else. The three motion and entry sensors, the water and climate sensor, yeah, detect water, humidity, and temperature, and then a uh, siren and keypad with two roo tags. Battery is manual, five stickers for your windows, nice, and uh, most importantly, and for me as well, peace of mind. Let's uh, change this view real quick and let's get to the unboxing. Let me get a uh, knife or something. All right, so this just has one little piece of tape here on the side. Got this yesterday, been dying to open it. All right, and then if we lay it back flat, this little flap opens up. Oh, look at that. That is some nice packaging. Two thumbs up to Kangaroo. So uh, as you can see here, it gives you a little bit of details. Read this first. Download the app. Follow the app. Uh, setup guide. Pair your siren and keypad. Pair your motion and entry sensors. Pair your water sensor. 
place your yard sign in a highly visible spot. So this is our yard sign, which, oh wow, hold on. Very, wow, this is like, I thought this was gonna be paper. No, this is like, this is like some thicker cardboard or something. Very, very nice. I am honestly blown away by that. I thought this was gonna be a cheap paper sign. I'm thinking this will have a user manual, three extra adhesives. Nice again. These guys went all out. Four mounting screws, two key rings, and five security stickers. Let's go ahead and pop this guy open. And that's what I think I have, the Kangaroo Complete. I get three months for free. I, I paid for a year. I don't know if I can get this three months as well, but I'm definitely going to find out. Two, three, five the double sided tape. Oh man, the cute, oh that's what, wow, they really went all out. I am honestly shocked and blown away here. Yeah, and then this is the manual, so it kind of tells you about everything. I doubt I'll really need this, I know how a lot of this works, but um, for some people this may be helpful. All right, now to the good stuff. Uh, a little piece of plastic holding this all in here. Oh, and this is even like nice foam. All right. So this looks a lot smaller than I anticipated. Um, I did not expect this to be plugged in like this. I thought it'd just plug in, but uh, that doesn't really matter to me. Looks like that's like an alarm button, like a panic button. So you hit that in case you were having an emergency. And then uh, just your pins, which, uh, I can say, I don't know if you can see in the camera, but you can't really see these. Maybe I think they'll light up though, so that'll help. And the cable looks to be pretty long, so that's nice. They include you with a power brick, so uh, that's always a positive. And then this is one of the tags. Not bad. The other tag, maybe different colors and everything. Love it. Girlfriend loves yellow, so I know she'll want this one. I'll definitely take the black one. Uh, then here is some of the sensors. I'm not entirely sure which sensor is which. These look to be the door ones, and this, I believe, is the water sensor. Yeah, that's probably what those little things are. This just sets on the floor. If water detects, boom, it goes off, lets you know, hey, you got a leak. So that's definitely the water sensor. And um, these are the three door and motion sensors. Little kangaroo logo on the bottom. Download our app before you pill me. Yeah, I'm not gonna pull any of these tabs or anything until I get in the app. This is just, of course, the little parts that uh, go with them. Um, it doesn't seem like, oh wow, they're like magnetic. It doesn't seem like there's any uh, you know, special ones that go with each one. It seems like they'll just all work with one another. So uh, yeah, I think that's it for the unboxing though. Nothing else under that phone. There's a, uh, doesn't seem to be anything under that, and I can't think of anything that's missing. So, very, very pleasantly surprised with the unboxing experience. All of the items uh, do not feel like cheap plastic or anything. These feel like really, really good quality items. And you can actually press this. Interesting. I wonder if they took another, um, yeah. I bet you anything, they took another cue from Google and uh, you can probably press this button to disable the door sensor so you can go out of the door. Do not quote me on that, but I will let you know later in the video. Get this on the table, I'm gonna get the app downloaded and get this set up. Next thing you'll probably see is uh, a little walkthrough of the app showing you everything set up and maybe some of the stuff I can do with this. So uh, let's get into that. And so here's everything kind of put out on the table, kind of a uh, view of everything that comes in this thing which is you know honestly like I said a lot um, I'm really blown away that they give you these that's just shocking love those though this is pretty standard um, uh, very surprised at five stickers a lot of times places give you one sticker like that these stickers cost them a bunch of money and I know they don't um, and then again this sign is uh, you know very very nice quality sign like it's not gonna get messed up easily so um, everything feels nice. It doesn't feel cheap. I am very, very happy 
with this so far, let me let you know how easy the setup is, if it's easy. But I think it will be, I'm fairly certain. So here's a quick little tour of the app. Um, as you can see, it even tells me that I dismissed my alarm a moment ago when I came inside. And uh, if I launch into the app here, identifiers that show me that it's unlocked. If I press the middle one, that means that I'm staying here. And if I press the right one, that means that uh, I'm leaving. This also tells me all my sensors. My back door is open. Um, there's not much to the app. If you click on climate, this tells me about my uh, kitchen sensor, which it looks like it says it's disconnected, which is weird, but I have water alerts. And um, this is just for support. You can do a chat or you can click the call me button and they'll give you a call. I have the complete plan, which is $10 a month, but uh, as you can see, it ends on 4-18-2021. So that's the first time that I'll actually have to pay for this because I got three months free with the kit and then I paid for the first year. This is just where you set your safety word and your home address and stuff like that. Integrations. This is how you integrate with Google Home. This is your siren preferences. Um, and it will also detect smoke detectors. And device management. This spot I found to be very interesting. Um, there's a few settings you can do here. But what's really weird is like you cannot, like I have my sensors for entry mode only. I'll explain why in a moment but I can't change this. The only way to change it from entry mode only to entry and sensor, or entry and motion, is to completely remove the sensor and then add it back. That part I did not like. And then this is just your notifications and uh, support again, add a new device, uh, invite users, and then con contact authorities, which I am going to enable once we know the system a little bit. So, a couple things, Man, my hair looks, I should, I'm gonna have to put gel in it before I go. Couple things about the alarm system. So I do love it, I think it's great. I can tell you though, it detected the dog. That was the first thing that happened. And we have a little, little short uh, beagle and um, it detected it when we left, it set off the alarm. Um, so then I, I couldn't get the alarm to stop, like I couldn't get the siren to stop going off. Uh, even though I disarmed the alarm and the only way to fix that was I had to arm the alarm for a second and then disarm it again and that stopped it. The only other issue I had was one sensor did not want to connect for me, which was weird, but uh, other than that, the other sensors worked perfectly fine. What I can show you as well is uh, this is a button, as I mentioned in the setup video. And uh, actually, when your system is armed, a lot like the Google one, you can walk up to this door, you press the button, and you have 10 seconds to open the door. And then this door just stays disarmed until you reclose it. And then it'll arm the door again. That way, if you have to get up at 3 in the morning or whatever to let your dog out, you don't have to completely disarm your alarm. You can just hit the button and go out the door. Um, personally, I'm really surprised. Uh, this has everything that I wanted in a, uh, in a security system. It has motion sensors built into the door sensors, which Google did with their Nest product and I loved, but I just didn't want to pay $400 for a Nest one. And as well, Nest sensors are like 60 bucks a piece. Um, and this one has everything that that has at half the price or third of the price and then also it's only ten dollars a month for monitoring so to me this is the perfect perfect alarm system i think it's great i think that uh it does what i need except for the motion having a pet may be a bit of a headache for you you may not want to use the motion sensors um, or maybe put them higher i put mine it says like four and a half five feet so i'm like five eight so like i kind of put them all like right here um but it still set them off, and uh, so we've just, I've had to delete them yesterday and re-add them so that uh, the motion was turned off on them. Other than that though, I totally give this system two thumbs up. I uh, think the price is perfect, the monthly price is perfect, the device has a ton of features, nothing feels cheap at all, it feels like really good quality stuff, and uh, I felt a lot better last night going to bed, honestly, just knowing that, you know, all of my doors were blocked with, um, the sensors, knowing that if somebody kicked in my back door at 3 in the morning, I was going to have an alarm go off. It just 
kind of relaxing. I think that's gonna do it for this video though. I uh, have to uh, get ready to go to work and everything. So uh, hopefully if this video helped you out any or gave you some information, click that like button for me and click subscribe down in the corner. And I will see you in the next video. Deuces.